Rod was a guest on The Graham Norton Show last night at 10.35 p.m. on BBC One. The legendary singer performed his single One More Time, which features on his new album, The Tears of Hercules, released yesterday. Also joining Graham on the couch was musical icon Lady Gaga and co-star Adam Driver, who are in Ridley Scott's new film House of Gucci. Josh Gad, of Frozen fame, featured to promote his new series Olaf Presents, while Great British Bake Off winner Nadia Hussein joined the star-studded lineup to discuss her BBC programme Nadia's Fast Flavours. Hollywood superstar Will Smith, who is a favourite of The Graham Norton Show, also dropped in for a catch-up with the chat show host. Rod is one of the best-selling musicians of all time, having sold over 250 million records worldwide and had 10 number one albums. He has also famously been married to loose women anchor Penny Lancaster since 2007. However, before Rod settled down with third wife Penny, the musician had a number of love interests. In 1973, when Rod was recording his fifth solo album, Smiler, he even had a whirlwind romance with Joanna, of absolutely fabulous fame. He explained in a throwback interview that Joanna was, one of his past conquests, but that she was, too upper class, for him. He told The Sun in 2012 that she was a, wonderful, wonderful girl, but, far too posh for Rod. Two years earlier the singer explained in more detail why his relationship with Joanna broke down. He told the Daily Express, she was a wonderful woman, she was so upper crust. I was actually afraid to talk because Joanna talked awfully wonderfully. And I was actually scared to speak to Joanna because I was a North Londoner. The Do Ya Think I'm Sexy singer reiterated that the actor was wonderful and admitted that the central reason for ending their relationship was that he wanted to pursue other women. He said, it's horrible. The only way I can defend myself is I was going through the cards, just trying to find the right woman. Joanna opened up about the relationship to the BBC in 2018, explaining that the pair had a short romance for about 20 minutes. She also revealed she was one of the first people to hear Rod's cover of Bob Dylan's Girl from the North Country, which was released on, Smiler. Joanna said, when I was in my late 20s I went out with Rod Stewart for 20 minutes I suppose. No, it was a little bit longer than that. He was so fabulous, he had, just done Maggie May. It was a time when he still wore pink satin and drove a Lamborghini and was glamorous. She added, I remember him pitching up early one morning, I mean quite late in the early morning, about three or four o'clock. He had this track and said, this is for you. It was Girl from the North Country, and I adore Bob Dylan. To hear Rod singing this fabulous song in his gravelly voice touched me so much. 